Uh, this year's Comic-Con, we have the most guests that we've had. It's our third year. Uh, we have Sergeant Slaughter, of course, who's WWE Hall of Fame, also from G.I. Joe. Uh, we have Roger Bumpus, who most people don't know his name, but they'll know his character Squidward from SpongeBob SquarePants, and this is the 20th anniversary year. Uh, Jim Shooter, uh, he is now considered the Stan Lee of Marvel Comics because he's the longest, or the, I guess the oldest living uh, editor-in-chief that ever worked at Marvel. And he actually was at Marvel when they took on Transformers and G.I. Joe. And then we got Larry Hama, who was working at Marvel at that time, and he created the file card for every G.I. Joe character ever made. I have been collecting since I was eight years old and actually got the business kind of started then because by the time I was in third grade I actually would buy two of every action figure one to open and one to leave in the package as a collectible and I actually sold that when I got older and put myself through college. I have been going to comic cons for close to 20 years and to meet anyone you had to drive a minimum of two hours to get there so three years ago, I had the idea that I was tired of driving two hours to meet people. So why not see if we can bring one to Eastern Kentucky? This year, it'll be at the Appalachian Wireless Arena located in downtown Pikeville. Uh, Friday night, we are opening the doors 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. to VIP only. And then Saturday, it will be open to the general public from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. I work on this for a year. I mean. As soon as one's over, I start planning the next one. And when you see people come out and appreciate the hard work that you're putting into it, that's a humbling thing. And that just makes you want to try harder the next year. So the more people that come out to show us that they appreciate it, the more we're going to work harder next year to make it even bigger.